John Gucci Foley here. Hey, I want to talk about today the power of visualization because this will allow us to not only accelerate but amplify our results but also our peace of mind because what we focus on grows. So I was just with Billy Kidd, one of the famous world-class uh, U.S. ski racers, and we were talking about how did he use visualization. I had just done a presentation, and I, I showed him how we used it on the blues, and he goes, John, you know, when you're, when you're doing a, a race course, we used to actually walk the course, step the course, they call it, and, and get down to not only just the turns, but where's the ice, where's the ruts, and you could get down to a two-minute race course. They could visualize it down to tenths of a second, or at least the best people could. Billy said he could only get it down to about two or three seconds. And that's the difference between being a medal, winning a medal and not to getting it down to tenths of a second. So how do we use it on the blues? You know, what we did is we in the briefing room, after we went through the scenario and you got yourself settled, uh, we got into this group visualization and it's a dynamic. And here's what we were doing. You're not only visualizing uh, the maneuvers you're gonna you're gonna do, but you're visualizing the voice comp, the the changes in the boss's voice. You're actually closing your eyes and you're picturing what's it gonna feel like. Uh, what are your three points, your checkpoints on the airplane? I could feel the G forces coming on, and that allowed me to prepare myself. So when it got into the jet, I just had to do it. You know, Steph Curry, I just watched his uh, preparation on Masterclass. He talks about his preparation and focus time. So this is something that is absolutely critical and it's a skill we can build. So here's what I want you to think about. What are you thinking about? That's actually it. What are you rehearsing in your mind right now? You know, is it chaos? Is it trouble? Uh, or is it how can I be that beacon of light in the world? How can I be a focus of leadership? And that's critical. So what I'd like you to do, quick action step is, I've taught you before the glad to be here wake up. Uh, I want you to think about uh, three things right now that you're grateful for. Use gratitude as a power to reset your mind. Look around, if you're outside like me, um, you know, I'd look at the beauty of the day, the green background. We just had some rain and it's beautiful. So I'm grateful for those experiences. And remember that we are connecting back to each other and we want to get ourselves focused first. That's what the power of visualization can do. Glad to be here.